So a warm welcome to you all. We will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. The teams then, Paris Saint-Germain against Barcelona. Well, I'm Peter Drury, and I'm joined in the commentary box by the familiar figure of Jim Begley. Hello, Peter, and hello to everyone watching. For me, it's a, it's a real thrill to be here. The instantly recognisable sound of the UEFA Champions League anthem, the perfect backdrop to this eagerly awaited night of European football. Look at the lineups. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Neymar. Neymar, surely. He has an array of skills that can elevate the quality of a match or, or change its course with a flash of brilliance. Uh, his talent can, can take this game to a, a higher level of excitement, and I hope it does. I think the opposition defence agree too. He's going to be the source of so many of their headaches. Sergio Busquets, Rakitic, and it's Rakitic. Sergio Busquets, now it's Luis Suarez, Thiago Silva, here's the guilty party there. Thiago Silva he is now in the last chance saloon. Well, he knew what he was taking on there, Peter, and special delivery from the ref. Thiago Motta. Pastore. Di Maria. Now it's Cavani. Lucas Mora. Sergio Busquets. Luis Suarez. Messi. Rakitic passes it through. He's got the ball glued to his feet. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. He's come loose. Fair attempt, just the wrong outcome. There's a lot of movement going on, there's no shortage of options. So I guess they're looking to play around their opponents as opposed to through them. Yeah, the style is designed to dominate the ball and so you dominate your opponents. It's a loose ball. Pastore. And it's Kozawa. There were better options before the ball was lost. Easy to save from up here, I know. Messi, Paris Saint-Germain still to register a shot on target. Rakitic, Di Maria, it's Verratti. Now it's Verratti, 
Pastore can shoot here. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? Gomez. Luis Suarez plays it out to the wing. Tries a through ball. Out to the flank. Dinho looking to get on the end of this. Now it's Rakitic. Thiago Motta. Marco Verratti comes sliding in. Now it's Cavani. Looks like a good ball through. Lucas Moura. Lovely feet. Chance! Has a hit! Too long to get the shot away. Well, look, that's what happens when you're caught in two minds. You just don't know what you're doing. Now it's Luis Suarez. Aurier gets his foot in there. Now it's Cavani. Now it's Di Maria. Ter Stegen gets it upfield. Rakitic. Neymar. Looks to slip it through. The assistant referee rightly gives him offside. Ooh, that was marginal, I'd say, very marginal. Thiago Motta. And it's Ferrati. Cavani. Urie. Now it's Lucas Moura. Chance! A chance! Balls come loose and the chase is on. Now the pass. Luis Suarez. With the ball through. Lucas Moura. That has put a stop to that. Rakitic tries a long pass towards the front. Rakitic gets it back. Hoisted towards the area. Is it in? Di Maria. has crossed the line, and it's a throw. Cavani. Here it is now, surely! Can he finish? Cavani with a shot! And the whistle's gone, presumably for offside. Keeper's got good distance on that. And that'll be the last act of the first half. So there was the first half. Paris Saint-Germain ended that first half in such a strong fashion. I think we'll just have to wait and see now if they can rekindle that drive and that determination. It's been great commitment, and that has to be maintained in the second half. So they head in no further forward. The score here, still 0-0. Paris Saint-Germain clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect. This was gone, that's a foul. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. Well, the protest continues, but in the end, they are defending the indefensible. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. And he's done it! Well, that's what top players do. They can seize the initiative almost single-handedly, and that goal eases them in front once more to make this second half look a little more promising. To Stegen, maybe was unsighted by his own defence there. Just look at the way the ball sneaked through that defensive line, and I don't think he could pick it up until it was way too late. Paris Saint-Germain take the lead, 1-0. Well, whatever the manager said in that dressing room at half-time, it's worked a treat. Coaxed out to the wing. Well, when the keeper lost control of that, usually a striker would, would react first, so that defender deserves praise. Iniesta. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. 
Looks to slip it through. Marco Verratti. Forward it goes. Now the pass. And the defence can get it clear. Pretty clear that he's being singled out. Yeah, and if they're going to try and stop him in this fashion, Peter, um, they're going to really test the referee's patience from here. Mancia gets it away. Iniesta. Now it's Messi. He's made sure that that won't get through. Aimed long and direct. Mathieu to the keeper and try something new. Oh, good interception. Pastore pumps it upfield. Now it's Di Maria. Di Maria going full steam ahead down the left flank. Saved it! And he's straight offside. Yeah, the ball then set up the opportunity for someone to go and meet it. Defenders were on their heels, he was on his toes. Oh, look, they should have reacted to that quicker, you know, still he was helped by the fact that the market was so poor. Now it's Luis Suarez, out to the left it goes. Neymar crosses one in. Well, he rushed into that and didn't give anyone a chance to get on the end of it. Marco Verratti. Neymar. Dinks one in. Luis Suarez! He's got away with one there. Tries to dink it in. Now it's Cavani. Mathieu hurtles into the tackle. Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Yeah, and it's very good play to force the initial error there. That's what created the opening in the first place. Oh, he really wanted that. Well, in all honesty, he's tormented that defence. They just can't handle him. Not much subtlety. He's launched himself there. I have to say, that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. Rakitic. Forwards into the last quarter of an hour. He scored early in the second half to make it 1 0. Cavani sticks in a foot to win it back. Cavani absolutely focused then on the defensive side of his game. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help Steered everyone. Steered out wide. In with a header! Neymar, Neymar! One of a type! He's brilliant! Barcelona are back in business! That is a fine goal, really efficiently done. Well, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met, it really was. Barcelona grab the equaliser, and we're all square. Listen, with the momentum that goal gives them now, they may well push for a winner before the 90 minutes is up. Players don't like extra time, believe me. Cavani, Dinia. Now it's Luis Suarez. Luis Suarez plays it out to the wing. Urie. Di Maria. Now it's Messi. And the counter is on. Verratti. It's Di Maria. Tries a through ball. Di Maria. Moves 
for the cross. Big moment! Massive goal! And you can't but admire that from a player from whom we expect to come to the fore at crucial, crucial moments. Doing it, however, is another matter, and his influence just grows and grows. A great delivery and a finish to match. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. He's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the efforts he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Paris Saint-Germain take what looks to be a decisive lead. Well, look, Peter, I feel I've got to stress that there's still time for another, so we can't be too presumptuous yet. Court shows there will be three extra minutes. Paris Saint-Germain need to hold on for a few more moments. Kuzawa. Matuidi. Pastore. Matuidi passes it through. Di Maria, decent ball. Hits one! And that is the last effort of the game. Well, whatever the shortcomings on either side, it was a great game to watch, just one between them. So a dramatic game decided in its very last moments. Well, I just think that determination and persistence has paid off handsomely to, to squeeze the win out of a draw. Sometimes it comes down to grit and desire and the stubbornness to keep plugging away. And uh, this has been great staying power.